In a very exciting news, Black Forest Labs has released Flux 1.1 Pro. If you don't know what Flux models are, you are missing out. And I'm not saying it lightly. Welcome to the channel. I hope that you are enjoying your day. In this video, we are going to have a quick look at this very newly released Flux 1.1 Pro model, which has been released by BFL or Black Forest Labs. This model has been on the top of the charts and I mean the Flux model for various months now. We already have covered the open source models in this family, both Dev and Chanel. Previously, we have installed them locally and we know that they are of very, very high quality. This Flux Pro 1.1 is not open source. It is only available at hosted platforms through API and that is a paid option, but you do get some free credits from few of the websites like Together and few others. So what exactly is this Flux 1.1 Pro? It is the most advanced and efficient model yet alongside the general availability of the beta BFL API. This release marks a significant step forward in their mission to empower creators, developers and enterprises with scalable state-of-the-art generative technology. Flux 1.1 Pro provides six times faster generation than its predecessors, which is Flux 0.1 Pro, which we already have covered on the channel. While this new model also improves image quality, prompt adherence and diversity. At that same time, they have updated Flux 0.1 Pro to generate the same output as before, but two times faster. If you go through their repo, they have few of the examples which they have generated with this Flux 1.1 Pro. And the second one where a man is walking on the road with a stick with some shadows is my favorite one. Look at this one. Also, if you look at this first one, that is also simply out of this world. As usual, the attention to detail from the output in this model is simply out of this world. Faster generation times and reduced latency has enabled more efficient workflows. Flux 1.1 Pro provides an ideal trade-off between image quality and inference speed. Flux 1.1 Pro is three times faster than the currently available Flux 0.1 Pro. Flux 1.1 Pro has been introduced and tested under the code name Blueberry into the AI image arena. It is a popular benchmark for text to image models and they have shared some of the findings. It doesn't look that good here. So maybe I'll just take you back to their website and we'll just scroll down. There you go. So you see the Flux 1.1 Pro, the first one has beaten the rest of all the lot. And not only it has achieved the highest ELO score, but as we already have seen, the image quality is simply amazing. It is simply out of this world. And we have tested it out in view of the benchmarks. And I can tell you for surety that this model is going to stay at the top for some time to come. In order for to, to get it tested, right now the pricing for the Flux.1 model is a bit expensive, I would say. It is around um, 2.5 cents per image, uh, sorry, 4 cents per image, which is quite expensive. And you can get started with this API at bfl.ml.com, which you can access and uh, it is going to take a bit of a time to, to get it generated. Another cool thing is that if you have already an account at together.xyz, you can use this model they also offer you some of the credits if you like so you see that i'm already logged into to the together.ai and i have selected this flux 1.1 pro either you can use this ui to generate an image just paste your text here or you could use this python code where <clears throat> they're just importing these libraries initializing the client specifying this model and then just putting in what sort of image um, dimensions do you want width and height and then printing the response back so let me try it out here i'm not sure if i have any credits at the moment but let's try it out so i've just given it a bit of a complicated prompt i have just ran it 
let's wait for it to see what it does there you go so you see if you look at my prompt it says a futuristic cyberpunk cityscape at dusk which is correct very nice with sleek skyscrapers and neon lights reflecting off the wet pavement look at the pavement amazing stuff it is wet and then it's a holographic bridge and you see the bridge is also showing all the holographics very nice the atmosphere is moody will settle with subtle fog and mist effect style blend of sit meat and hr charger with intricate details and texture very nice so let's try to draw some human figure now in the next one i am trying to draw a human figure i'm asking it that a stunning elegant women with long curly auburn hair and piercing emerald eyes and her slender figure grasps a delicate antique violin so let me scroll down let me scroll up a bit there you go and there is a violin and subtle ethereal glow surrounds her as if infused with magic the forest is alive with soft twinkling fireflies and the scent of blooming wildflowers and look at the fireflies how good is that in the background a majestic ruined castle looms its turrets and spires shrouded in mist with vines and moss reclaiming the ancient stone how good is that very nice and let's try out another one so i'm asking it a breathtaking young goddess with long flowing golden hair and piercing sky blue eyes sits atop a majestic snow white unicorn on a pristine sun kissed beach at dawn the unicorn's horn shines with a soft rainbow light and its mane flows like silk in the gentle breeze let's see how my long my credits last so let's wait for it and you can see the speed is also quite good very nice look at the unicorn look at the background looks really amazing the horse is sitting and look at its feet and the sand attention to detail as i said is quite good and look at uh, the formation of horse even human figure is nice the hands are quite good feet are also good yeah slight deformation at the feet as you can see but I think much better than the previous models. And finally, let's try out another one. In this one, I'm asking it two figures, a man and a woman, clad in tattered dark attire, plummet together through a seemingly endless airy abyss. Their faces contorted in terror, their arms outstretched and their fingers intertwined. The surrounding darkness is punctuated only by faint flickering wisp of luminescent mist revealing glimpses of twisted gothic architecture and before i run it let me give a huge shout out to the sponsors of this video which are agent ql agent ql is a query language that turns any web page, web page into a data source with its python sdk and live debugging tool you can scrape and interact with web content agent ql works on any page it is resilient it is reusable and it structures output accordingly. Agent QL is a robust alternative to fragile XPath and DOM CSS selectors as it uses the power of AI to analyze the page structure to find the data you are looking for. Okay, so let's go back to together and run it. Let's wait for it to come back. The speed is quite good too. Hmm, interesting, not bad at all. So you see, its adherence to instruction following is really cool. So it has done what I have asked it. Very, very nice. So all of these images, I believe they are of very, very good quality. Let me know which one is your favorite. And if you are any, if you are creating any images, want to share it, feel free to put it in the comments. If you like the content, please consider subscribing to the channel. If you are already subscribed, please share it among your network as it helps a lot. Thank you for watching.